Hi, I'm Natasha Frakes and you're watching Market One Minute. Joining us is Javier Reyes from Core Gold. Now you and your bank are the biggest investors in Core Gold. So can you tell us about what you think of the progress that's been made? Um, uh, we're very happy with the progress that the management has accomplished. They've been able to bring the, uh, the mine back into production after just four months. So now we're very pleased with the progress and we're going to be focusing on optimizing the production uh, at Dynasty Goldfields. Tell us more about Dynasty Goldfield and what's so special about it. What is wonderful about Dynasty Goldfields is not just that it's the only uh, and first open pit mining operation in Ecuador, but it's pretty high, high grade and low cost. So I think that's what it's amazing about and it has a lot of exploration upside. Ecuador has had a bit of a spotty reputation with mining investors. So what's your experience been there? Since we bought back in September 2016, our experience has, uh, has been a pretty good one. It's been a very pro-mining uh, country and very pro-business. And actually, uh, with considering our experience in Mexico, it's easier to do mining in Ecuador than in Mexico. And I think that's what uh, makes uh, a mining operation sustainable into the future. And so what are you looking forward to over the next year with Core Gold? So we'll be focused on optimizing the production, increasing the plant capacity, and testing our new targets in the Dynasty Goldbird, uh, where Dynasty Goldfield sits. So, so far we have 2 million ounces and we expect to increase Dynasty Goldfields as well as uh, test the new targets, which is Copper to and Linderos. Sounds like there's a lot of exciting things to look forward to. Thank you so much for being here, Javier. Thank you, Natasha.